I don't remember a time when I wasn't fascinated with space or science in general. At least since the age of three, I have loved space and always wanted to go into it as a profession. In college at Houghton, I majored in physics. I was actually a great student, but a terrible physicist. But I was also very determined. I wanted to get my degree in physics. Actually, the people having the most fun were the scientists working on missions that fly throughout our solar system. And I realized that they're not astronomers or astrophysicists. Most of them are actually geologists. Sitting in the geology control room, uh, as the New Horizons spacecraft was flying past Pluto in July of 2015. And everyone in the, in the control room was looking at this other guy's monitor. I'm like, guys, there's mountains on Pluto. And then finally someone turned around and said, hey, look at Kirby's computer. There's mountains on Pluto. I'm like, that's what I've been trying to tell you guys. So as far as I know, I'm the first person to discover mountains on Pluto. Having a well-rounded education, I think, is really important because it gives you so many different places of your brain to draw from to solve problems. In my interest for having science and art influence each other, I, I would broadly include religion in the realm of art. Getting to explore the solar system is like playing in God's backyard. And so to go out and play in God's cosmic backyard to see what different worlds are like under different conditions is really fun and really satisfying.